Hey guys, myself Rakesh and in this video we are going to learn how can you delete an already created repository in GitHub and many people also will have a question how can I create a new one. So both these topics I am going to cover in this video. So let's get started. The first thing if you are on a different page click on this GitHub icon and then you will be coming to the home page. On the home page on the left side right on the left side panel you see there will be repository names available over here. Let's say I would like to delete this repository. So what I should do? All I have to do is click on this repository. And then here you find the settings button, right? So all you do, click on the settings button and your answer is in front of you. All you have to do, you have to scroll down. Many people would like to change the name of a repository. So this is the place you can rename uh, your repository. That is one of the way. And the other one is scroll down. Scroll down and you will find something called danger zone. And here you have an option called delete repository. Quite simple. So here click on this delete this repository and it's going to ask you once it is deleted, it cannot be undone, right? It cannot, you cannot get it back. So go through this disclaimer carefully and then all you have to do, you need to type this. So instead of typing, you can also copy paste or you can type up to you, but ensure that there are no space. If there is a space, the button will not be enabled so ensure there is no space uh, right everything is written properly then this button is enabled to delete so this is the way you can delete it okay so you understood how to delete a repository now the question is how can you uh, get it back so let me try to log in All right, so now we are going to see how do you create a repository. So create a repository is very simple. I'm going to hit on create repository or you would have a new button there. Click on create repository. Then give it a name. Let's say I would like to give it a name called, let's say I want to work, I'm working on a project called, it's a bank project, let's say. I'm giving the name of the bank as A1, let's say, bank A1. So this is the project name I have given. And then you do not like to definitely keep it as public. You would like to make it a private one. So I'll select private. And then you can also choose who can commit to this repository. So leave all the option as it is for the moment. And then hit on create repository. You are learning. So this should be enough. Create it private. And then your repository is created. And this is your link. How do you integrate this with UiPath? I have already created a video on automate with Rakesh channel. Go to the playlist or go to the video section search for github integration video there you would find your answer thank you guys for watching this we're going to come up with more such interesting concepts for you in the upcoming videos take care bye bye